This week's Easy Way video, I'm Marissa from Beautifully Organised. So I have five minutes today while Georgia is napping and Sophie is playing with Play-Doh and I thought I would share with you how I do my nails really quickly and easily. Now they're nothing particularly fancy, this is what they look like. See? I just use a really pale pink most of the time and they're just short and tidy and glossy and that's how I like them. I just find that having my nails nice and in good condition um, means that I tend to take better care of my hands in general which you know makes life easier in the long run as far as my hands go so that's why I do that and also you know it's a little bit of something nice where even if I'm having a busy day with the kids and you know I haven't had time to get particularly dressed up you know or have my hair and makeup done like obviously today it's still nice to have nice nails they kind of just make me feel that little bit prettier and there's nothing wrong with wanting to feel that little bit prettier when you're flat out running after your kids so anyway that's why I'm gonna do this video is just to show you what I use in my nail kit to make doing my nails a lot easier so now that I'm done rambling let's jump right in and I'll show you what I do so let's take a look at my kit this is it it's just a standard two layer bag this one is from Nutramedics it was a couple of years ago that I got this um, but you can get toiletry bags anyway you know big W Kmart um, you can get fancy ones at beauty places, I mean, whatever you like, really. I like to keep everything for my nails in the one bag, and that way it's just a grab and go. If I've got five minutes, I just grab the bag, everything's in there ready to go, and that's why it's so nice and easy to do my nails in a hurry. In the top layer, I keep my polishes, just tucked in there. I always have a standard pale colour, so this is the... I think this is called Pink of Heart. And the other colour that I normally keep is a, you know, a darker reddish colour. So this is the one I have now. This is Skyfall from the Bond collection. Have a quickie double base coat and top coat. So those are my polishes. Let's have a look at the bottom layer of my bag. And this, this is everything else. So in the bottom layer of my bag, I always have nail polish remover. That's a Woolies one. I have these little nail polish remover pads. These ones are Nutramedics. I think you can get other brands. These are really, really handy. If I'm in a hurry, I just take one of these out and rub it over my nails. And it doesn't sting like some nail polishes do. These are acetone free, so maybe that's why. So I have a nail file. I keep a similar one in my handbag, so I've always got one in each spot. And then just standard nail clippers. Let's keep hand cream. This is a really, really good one for my skin. I have really, really dry, sensitive hands, and I've found that that works really well. And I use the Nutramedics apricot oil as well uh, for cuticles. Now, all that's left to show you are my two secret weapons for easy nails. The first one is this. This is the OPI Drip Dry, and I'm almost, almost done with mine. All I have to do is put my colour on my nails and then my top coat on my nails and then after about a minute I put two drops of this on each nail and they're dry almost straight away. It's amazing stuff. I really like OPI in general because the brush size is really, really good and the formulation is really good. So if I've got hardly any on the brush, it will still coat my nail really well with three swipes of the brush and then it's done. My last secret weapon when I'm doing my nails is this little makeup brush this is a really really old one and what I do is I use these two together if I'm doing darker colors on my nails I tend to find that if I'm in a hurry I get nail polish all over my finger so what I do if that's the case at the end I just get this little makeup brush and dip it in a little bit of nail polish remover and then I just grab my brush and kind of you know sweep it down along my nail like that and just basically clean up any drips that I've had. Now I got that tip from Sonia on YouTube and I will link her channel to the bottom of this one if you want to check out what else she does as far as nails and beauty and all of that stuff goes. She's really, really good. So that's it. That's how I do my nails on the go in a hurry and have them turning out quite pretty without having to spend too long. This is Sophie. I don't know if you've met Sophie before, but if you haven't, this is Sophie, my beautiful three-year-old. And show everybody your arm. Oh, she's got a sore arm. If you follow Beautifully Organised on Facebook or Twitter, you'll see that she broke her arm on Boxing Day and we spent, how many days did we spend in hospital? Uh, I don't know. I think three. And you had a little operation. Mm. And she's doing very well. Mm. So, <laughs> as you can see, she's doing well. 
So anyway, if you think that this video has helped you out and you know somebody who would benefit from watching it, then share it with them and don't forget to pop over to beautifullyorganized.com, sign up for your free email updates and get your free ebook while you are there. I will see you in next week's video. Have a great week. Bye. Bye.